Hello everybody and welcome back to Provis Gaming and more Prison Architect and Klaus's Wunderstrafenstalt. We had another attempt to break out if you missed it last time. We managed to stop it, but we had to just spontaneously, you know, create a bunch of guards. Hey look, $20,000 for a grant completion. We're up to 200 capacity. Boom! So, now that that's all done, uh, I guess what we should do is start working on the maximum security wing that I've built here, yes? Yes. Uh, all right, let's go ahead and build up some walls then. First things first, walls, like so. Now we said that one of these was gonna be a shower. Mm, okay, hey, yeah, I'm, I'm trying to think this through again. So this was the kitchen, small little isolated kitchen just for this prison. This is the common room, this leads into a canteen. This goes here, here, that's a cleaning cupboard. This was supposed to be laundry. This is supposed to be a shower. This is supposed to be a nursery. It's supposed to be a small staff room, and this is supposed to be all of the cells for the said maximum security scam. Okay, kind of like this. Whoop! Doop 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 doop. And of course, we'll have some family cells on the top as well. Like so. I wish there was like a button where like if you plan something out, you just like hold control and click on the planning. It just fills it out with immediate, like immediately with brick wall. That'd be kind of convenient. But they don't do that. So what did we discover? Was it was it a, was it a tunnel? I don't know. Anyway. Cigarettes, that's what we found. Some early release prisoners, noise. Should we search a cell block? Well, I'm gonna go ahead and search out the um, maximum security cell block real quick. Oop, the chief is calling. We've just discovered that one of the teachers we bring in for the inmates classes has been smuggling in huge amounts of contraband. They've been fired, but the damage has been done at this point. So what you're telling me is I need to do a shakedown. That's gonna cause a problem, FYI. Let's do it. Why not? Massive search. Whoa, what was that? Was that like some sort of weird effigy? What is this? Oh, it's like a pole with a stake on it. We're finding all sorts of contraband, no kidding. That was one terrible teacher. He slash she should be very much ashamed. Look at all the contraband we're finding right now. Oh my gosh. This is terrible. If only we were playing as like, what's her name? Rita or something? Like the lady who can sell contraband and make a ton of money? Oh my gosh, I'd be a freaking rich right now. I'm terrible at stopping contraband from coming into the prison, apparently. What were these prisoners doing out here? How are they out here? What are you doing? Like, for, for real though, how'd you get out here? And what are you doing? Also, why is this door facing the weird, uh, weird direction? I don't know. But I have no idea what you're doing out here. You shouldn't have any way out. How'd you do it? I need to know. This is, this is, this is absolute, why is there, why is there vomit everywhere? Clearly some prisoners got out and been wandering looking for a way out. Okay. Hi prisoner, search. Search prisoner. Aha! Found some contraband. What are you doing out here? Okay, I got a hole somewhere. Clearly. Where, do, where, where, where does I has a hole? Well, our snitch is informing us about all sorts of terrible things. She's gonna die soon enough. Um, forestry area. Forestry. Let's just go ahead and expand this all the way out. Done. Ooh! Big forestry area. Yeah, though, like... How did they get out here? Okay, I need to select this door. If you'll let me in for a second, I'll help you out. Guys, thank you. Lock open. There we go. Okay, uh, I don't like that this door is facing the wrong direction. Can someone please fix that? Finding all manner of contraband. Really glad we did a shakedown. Really glad the chief let us know that that teacher was a horrible person who was supplying prisoners. Who would do something like that? Who supplies a prisoner? Are you just asking to get sh sued? Because I feel like you might be. All right, objects, staff door, rotate the right direction. There we go. Maybe because it was facing the wrong direction, they could just like sort of sneak through. But then why couldn't they get back in? Hey, it's raining. It hasn't rained here in a long time. Okay. How are the prisoners' needs? I imagine they're all very upset. 
Hygiene's quite bad. Food, sleep, they're all working on sleep right now. Oh, found a tunnel. We found the tunnel and they're all like, oh, cram, scatter, run. And this lady's got a stake and scissors. Oh, we need to get some prisoners down here ASAP and stop them. Oh, these ladies are hiding in the bathroom so we don't beat them up. Yeah, that's going to work out well. And we have a death. Let me guess. A snitch? Yep. No, wait. No. Aya JD's wifey. Aya, otherwise known as JD's wifey, is a mother of eight children and married to JD. I'm guessing that's another prisoner in this game. So, were you discovered with a knife and we tried to apprehend you? Looks like some people got into a bloody fight. Well, she's dead now. Oh, that's fun. What happened here? Surrounded by walls and doors. It is surrounded by walls and doors. Are you talking about the tunnel? I'm talking about the tunnel, I am sure. Yeah, at this point, I think that you guys have lost your privileges with the doors. So I'm getting rid of these. That's it. I try to be nice. Alright? I try to give you bathroom stalls. And then you betrayed my trust. And you started digging tunnels trying to escape. I can't, I can't tolerate that. Sorry. No privacy now. Everyone gets to watch you poop. Oh, someone else died. Was this also a snitch? AJ. Wait. Wasn't AJ the lady... AJ's wifey? Was that the one who also got killed? Wow. I guess AJ didn't want to live without her wife or something. I don't know. They both died together. Which is okay. One more place to search. Can someone please do it so we can end the shakedown finally? Please. Thank you. All right. These minimum security prisoners have completely violated my trust. That's all I got to say. Um, kind of tempted to put like a fence around this area. And we're just like, hey, you dig a tunnel. Oh, no. You found yourself in a cage. Well done. Well done. Let's go ahead and do it, actually. I kind of I, I kind of want to do it. Just to see if they dig a tunnel and they don't know and they get stuck in here. And I'm like, aha! I know someone was doing something illegal. That's funny. Hang on. Have them go around kind of like this. There you go. Yeah, we'll just we'll just place a little extra fencing around it. Hmm. There's definitely a way to be more strategic about how you place your prison as far as like where the cells are in relation. Like this is one of the reasons I like to have the cells kind of closer to the center of the map. As opposed to over here along the edge, which is what I did in my first ever prison, uh, Tiddlewing's Funhaus. That didn't go very well. So, I've given myself a wide berth where I can detect their tunnels before anything else happens. Oh, looks like all the walls have finally been put together. That's nice. Let's go ahead and, uh, plan out some, uh, electrical cables. There we go. doop a doop 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 a doop uh, do a doop do doop ba doop a doop Ba-doo-ba-doo. There. That should be good enough, I think. Of course, we probably need to get a few extra capacitors along here. One, two, three, four, five. Eh, not five. Just four. Of course, now we've paid for it, so I guess we really might as well. Uh, deployments. We're going to say this is a staff-only area. No one's allowed in here. That'll do fine. Okay. So my thought is, we're going to go ahead and try to get this maximum security figured out. We have 39 more prisoners on the way. Okay, that's too many. It's 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 too many. Intake. Number per day, you can have, whoop, you can have like 20, but I'm not taking another 37. This is ridiculous. Can't handle it, okay? Fragile heart can't handle it. Let's hire some more staff. Four guards. We're going to need more staff rooms. This is not going to be enough, is it? Nope. Definitely not. Whatever. Oh, no. Poor workman got stuck. Hang on. Let me, let me get you a way out. Hang on. Hang on. Staff door. There. Okay. Mm. Yeah, this poor guy's just stuck. I could fire him, and he'll just, like, despawn from the map. That solves the problem. But no, we're not going to worry about it. We have to repair some stuff. Who's blowing things up? Stop! St why did you have to destroy your toilet? That's, why you're, it's, that's, that's where you take a crap. You know? You need that. You should be grateful that I even gave you a... A bathroom. I was thinking about not doing it. I was thinking about it. Okay, a couple more little airlock things going on there. I'm going to deliberately try to control the flow. I know they're going to take a long way around to get to their kitchen and stuff, but I want to make sure 
And I got a whole bunch of like metal detectors and stuff in place. Make sure they're not going anywhere. By God. Can you lock open this door, please? Just lock it open. Thank you. You too. Lock open. Done. Uh, is someone going to finish this last electrical cable? You are. Good. And that solves the problem. Sweet. Okay. Got $17,000 to work with. What's going on here? 138 prisoners have serious complaints. Food or family? Which one is it? Or are you just upset that I did a shakedown? Turned out that shakedown was completely validated. I mean, a couple people died, but... That's what we needed to do. Hmm. Kind of worried that this, um canteen may not be large enough why is this not working build more cctv oh there's nobody operating the monitor well why not who's blowing up the chapel oh good grief attacking the pews have you no sense of like i don't know reverence none at all it's fine. Bench. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Giving them as much space as possible. We need to get a serving table. Let's first go ahead and start uh, classifying some of these rooms. So, this is going to be the new kitchen area. And we will place a staff door right here. Uh, canteen. Go right along here. Okay. Maybe we won't make this the common room. I mean, we could make it a common room. We could also make this a small common room, but we'll make that a common room. It's probably okay, right? Probably. I don't know. Um, kitchen deliveries, cleaning cupboard. Cleaning cupboard we did say we want here. It's hard to find everything that I'm looking for here. Yard. We will need a yard. Should probably go ahead and place a yard like so. And we'll place a fence around this. Yeah. That'll be fine. Give them access to the yard. Their own separate yard. So they have yard time. I don't want them going into the uh, normal security area. Let's see. Shower. Yep. We need that. Common room. Place right here. Okay. Uh, la 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 la. More security, office, storage, yard, shower, workshop, garbage. Laundry. Goes there. Where's the nursery? Missing it somewhere. Nursery. There you are. Place you here. I need a staff room. Right here. Okay. That's all the major rooms planned out, ready to go. Now, one thing I could do is start placing some really good perimeter wall around this area. Kind of an expensive thing to do. Costs $200 per square. I mean, that's a lot. But yeah. Uh, apparently my staff are unhappy. Why? Food. I don't have enough food. Look, I'm trying. If you come out here, there's plenty of food up here. Go eat, guys. I don't care that much about their needs, honestly. Let's be honest. I don't. I don't really care. I don't really care. The staff. The staff is not going to riot and cause an issue. I hope. Unlike the prisoners who actually try to kill people. So, I mean, when I have to evaluate fre threats and determine which one gets priority, it's not the staff. It's just not the staff. Look at all these trees that are going to be uh, growing up. Good dog. You smelled poison. Well done. So, 20 prisoners arriving. Um, no. Let's close it off for a little bit. I'm not in the mood to take on any more. Uh, let's see. While all these people are out, let's search the cell block. We'll do this here as well. Search this cell block. Again, while the prisoners are out so they can't complain, we're just going to go see if we can find anything. More tunnels. Found some knives. Stuff like that. Oh, people are dying in the church. Stop it! Stop killing people in the church! We found someone trying to build a tunnel here. Why? No, for real, though. There's a tiny little flag there, but, like, why would you... Why would you be digging a tunnel through to the kitchen? You're just trying to get a late-night snack? That might be what's going on. No idea. Dog smelled something. Find no evidence of it. More people are dead. 
Oh, no. Okay. Well, <laughs> let's go ahead and just keep working on the maximum security area. Uh, basic cells. Eh, it's a little cramped. I could give them more space so they're less likely to cause an issue, but come on, they're going to cause an issue anyway. Doop -a doop 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 doo do 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 Okay. Wish there was a family cell option here in the quick build, but there's not. So we'll have to do it manually. Pay some jail doors. Bed. Doop 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 doop. Whoop. Nope. Doop. There we go. Crib. Uh, actually, let's just go ahead and mark them as family cells so we can actually zoom in and find them a little bit easier. There you go. Yeah, thank you. Okay. Uh, crib. Come on. There you go. Crib. Toilet. Doop a doo doop a doo doo. Place you here. Drains. And shower head. You know, we've never had to make use of these sprinklers, by the way. I consider myself lucky a little bit, but never had to worry about that. Staff door. I'm not going to let prisoners work these uh, areas here. It's not going to be worth that. Ah. Uh, I'm going to plan out the shower space here. So we'll do that. Place a drain. Play some shower heads. Let's actually give them a lot more space to work with. I don't feel like provoking them because they're standing too close. Let's see. We actually should consider expanding out this laundry area, by the way. We have uh, space for it. Let's get a couple more laundry machines. Let's get another ironing board or two. Whoops. Hmm. Can you guys access that? I have no idea. You know, either way. Do we need more janitors? Because I swear this place is just getting dirtier every time I look around. This prison is disgusting. Hey, early release. A few thousand extra dollars. Okay. So we're finally getting done over here. Mm. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. What is there to do right now? Okay, we've actually we've accidentally filled this place up. You guys need to place these jail doors is what you need to do. That'll work. Now they can place them. <sighs> Klaus's Wunderstrafenstalt is massive. Klaus's Wunderstrafenstalt is exhausting. <laughs> we need some more utilities. Large pipes. Okay. I'm gonna place a large pipe along up here. Like this. And up here. Like this. Go to the kitchen as well. Place you guys down here. I think I'm going to place a water boiler in here as well. In the laundry room. Since that area is uh, accessible only to staff. But a little bit of hot water. Might actually persuade them not to like go crazy. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Okay, first things first for logistics or deployment. I'm going to say this entire area is staff only. Do not assign... Whoop. Actually, yeah. Sure, let's assign this entire outside area as staff only. No one should be in there. Yeah, no one should be out there at all. No access to this yard. I'm aware. There's a large jail door here. And here. Okay. So yeah, I don't want any prisoners coming in here. I don't want anyone assigned... Whoa. Hi guys, do a little dance. Yeah. Seriously guys, <laughs> calm down, don't spaz. It's gonna be fine. What are you worried about? All right, let's get them a wide sofa. Actually, first things first, pool table. Goes here. Wide sofa. Goes here. I'd like to get a large TV. Got any large TVs? There you are. There you go. Place another wide sofa like this. And a bookshelf or two. And a phone booth or two. There you go. There's a little bit of stuff for this common room, you know. 
try to dissuade these guys from going too crazy in a very short amount of time. All right, we also need to get some staff doors. Place here. Fail door goes here. Uh, we need metal detectors. This one here, 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 and here. So they have to walk through it. Here and here. Here, here. We're going to run out of money. Yep, I'm out of money. Okay. I guess we'll just sit back and not do anything for a little while. Let's chop down some more trees. Objects. Dismantle objects. Hover mouse over trees equals profit. I mean, we make like $17,000 a day right now. I mean, I would say that that's pretty good. Would hope, anyway. Whoa. See the little green spurts? These trees are just popping out. All just like, poof! Here I am. I am a tree. Yes, I know you are a tree. Thou art a beautiful tree. Can you please place these doors so these guys will stop spazzing? High priority. Higher priority. Give them a way out. I, mean, I could just demolish the walls and they'll figure it out, but... For real, though. Who is... This toilet needs to get searched, apparently. <laughs> That's absolutely critical. Here comes... Nope, here comes a water boiler. Who's got the doors? Does anyone have a door? Nobody has a door. Oh, well. What time is it? Oh, it's actually about time to be ending this video. Okay, cool. So I'm going to end this video here. Um, and then next week, what we're going to do is we're going to finish off the series. We're going to finish off this uh, maximum security. We're going to play with it for a little while. And then uh, maybe, just maybe, we will try to escape from our prison. From Klaus's evil clutches. And then we will say that's the end of it. And I'll move on to some other things. Like, I don't know, Urban Empire or something. Thank you all very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Be sure to hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe. Let me know if I'm forgetting something really important for this maximum security area. I'm thinking I'll place some perimeter fences around this to be safe. But, you know, I'm open to suggestions. And, of course, actually, we should just do one quick check. Oh, my gosh. Cell block E. Fine, why not? Let's do a quick check on general education. There's one person interested. One person is interested. Reschedule all programs. Crap. It's not enough. Okay, we're going to finish our foundation education program, and then once that's done, we'll try to get one person to learn algebra, and that will be the end of this grant, and I'll get 40000 bucks. We'll see. All right, yes. Anyway, end of the video. Thank you all. Bye-bye. <laughs>